some of the Democrats only had a, a good night. And um, according to some of the trackers uh, online, uh, Senator Cory Booker of New Jersey uh, actually did uh, the most talking. And I think to some uh, to strong effect, uh, he, uh, he spoke passionately about uh, gun violence and the toll it's taken on his own community in New Jersey. Uh, he uh, discussed uh, immigration. Um, it, was a, it was a successful night for him. I think uh, also Senator Elizabeth Warren will be satisfied. Um, she went into this as the, uh, the top tier candidate uh, on the first night, really, and um, uh, emerged unscathed. Uh, other candidates did not really try to take her down. And uh, she spoke powerfully about uh, economic uh, justice and uh, how society has been loaded in favor of the wealthy, um, in her view. And when uh, an argument did break out about health care, um, uh, nobody really landed uh, a punch uh, on her. Uh, Julian Castro, as well, former housing secretary, uh, performed strongly. And uh, some of the lesser known candidates, uh, John Delaney, as well, also had a couple of uh, good moments. Now, you mentioned it just there. Healthcare did come out as a really key issue here. I think we certainly saw one of the um, most dramatic uh, clashes uh, on healthcare, uh, certainly in the first uh, hour of the uh, debate. Um, Elizabeth Warren uh, set out her policy of uh, Medicare for all. Um, and Beto O'Rourke, um, however, talked about uh, allowing some people to keep their private health insurance if they want it. Uh, and that, that produced the first interruption of the night from the New York Mayor Bill de Blasio, who uh, said this was not working for millions of Americans. And perhaps that should have been Beto O'Rourke's moment to step in. But um, many are saying he had a disappointing night and said it was left to John Delaney to defend the principle of uh, people keeping their private insurance if they wanted to. And, and that really showed one of the few major ideological differences among the candidates tonight uh, and indeed tomorrow night. Uh, the likes of Warren and, and Sanders uh, really did believe in shifting to more like a British-style system like the National Health Service of Medicare for All, whereas uh, other candidates who are a bit more centrist and conservative are saying um, that would be too radical that uh, the private sector still has uh, a role to play.